Oh, bull bond. Kind of a private oasis for the kids at Buckner. I went there maybe two or three times. I'm sure there are lots, a thousand stories from other people about Bull Pond, but I can only tell you my story. I swam there once, I went fishing there once, and I just maybe one or two more times just to check it out and to see if it was real, and it was real. And there was a bull there, but he's very old. He didn't show up all the time. He uh, always looked more confused than we were to see him. We were afraid and he looked confused. Poor thing. This was maybe half mile, three quarters of a mile from back side of Buckner and from the football field. Could have been a mile, I don't know. Seemed like it took forever to walk there and walk back. Just kids having fun on Saturday afternoon. I think this was a real uh, sort of natural pond. It didn't look like a pond that a farmer had dug. It looked like it had always been there for a hundred years. It had full grown trees around it. it. May have even been sp spring fed at one time. It was always a mysterious place, too. It's had a lot of snakes and grasshoppers and mosquitoes and pond is still there. Spring might have dried up and they might have plowed over it and built a building by now. It's about done in 2020, right during COVID. It's just another look at a very private world. I guess we at Buckner had everything. We didn't know it. But we certainly had companionship, I'll say that. Nobody lacked for companionship. Oh, Bull Pond. You guys come back and have a great day.